moment surround sound, the real story gets lost. It always does. The heated debate has created more confusion than clarity. So we decided to do a quick classroom on the citizenship law. Five questions and answers, facts versus rumors. You can save it as a ready reckoner. Question number one, what is the Citizenship Amendment Act? It's a new law that serves a single purpose. Easier citizenship for non-Muslim immigrants from three neighboring countries, Afghanistan, Bangladesh and Pakistan. Indian citizenship for those who face religious persecution in these countries. In the last seven decades, lots, lots of persecuted Hindus from these countries have come to India. Many have been struggling. This new law will fast track their citizenship. Question two, who can get citizenship under this law? It is exclusively for Hindus, Sikhs, Buddhists, Jains, Parsis and Christians. And that too from only three countries, Pakistan, Afghanistan and Bangladesh. As per the old law, immigrants had to wait for 11 years to get citizenship. After the new law, it will take them six years. This does not mean that others, including Muslims, cannot apply for Indian citizenship. They will just have to wait longer to get it. Question number three, does the law affect every Indian? Does it affect citizenship, your citizenship in any way? No, it does not. There are no new rules for existing Indian citizens. If you're already a citizen, this does not affect your life. Question number four, what about persecuted Muslims? Are they banned from Indian citizenship? No, any foreigner, persecuted or not, Muslim or not, can apply for citizenship in India. This includes Muslims from Pakistan, Bangladesh and Afghanistan. They will only have to follow the old rules. And the final question, number five, is the Citizenship Amendment Act just like the NRC? These are two separate things. The NRC, the National Register of Citizens, for now is just limited to the state of Assam. It's basically a database of the citizens living in Assam. The government of India says NRC will be imposed nationwide and people are not happy with this idea. The Northeast is worried that a large influx of Bangladeshi Hindus will change the demographics of the region. The rest of India believes that a combination of the NRC and the citizenship law is dangerous. It's a potent tool in the hands of the government which can potentially strip a large number of people of their Indian citizenship. This though is not a fact, it's conjecture and must be treated as such.